Oman, the only country in the world ruled by a real sultan. 1. Oman is the world's only sultanate. A sultan is different from a king. He's a religious authority as well as a monarch. Oman is an absolute monarchy. 2. Oman has four deserts and zero rivers. It's one of the world's driest countries. The sultanate depends on a system called offlodge. It's an intricate network of irrigation channels. They bring water from the sources to the farmland. The irrigation system is over 1,000 years old. 3. Oman has its own religion. Officially, the state religion of Oman is simply Islam, but it's different from other Gulf countries. Most Omanis practice Abadism. Abadi Islam is more moderate than Sunni or Shia. It has been practiced in Oman since the 8th century. 4. Oman is the oldest continuously independent Arab country. It was originally founded as the Omani Imamate in the 8th century. It has plenty of ancient ruins and buildings. The most striking are Oman's famous forts. There are more than a dozen of them. Many locals believe the forts are haunted. 5. Oman has a reputation for witchcraft. Among the other Gulf states, it's sometimes called voodoo country. One of the reasons is the abundance of ancient ruins. Many Muslims believe that all uninhabited places are haunted. The Bagla Fort, for example, is supposedly full of jinni. For some people, it's a reason to stay away. But many Emiratis, and even Saudis, travel to Oman incognito. They seek help from local witch doctors. All of this is supposed to be illegal, but it continues to this day. 6. Southern Oman has its own season. This region depends entirely on the monsoon season. It's known as Karif, and runs from June to September. During this time, Southern Oman is transformed. Constant rains and fog turn it into a green paradise. The rest of the year, it's mostly yellow and tan. Karif is celebrated with an annual festival in Salala. It's one of Oman's main tourist attractions. 7. Oman used to be a major empire. The Omani Empire reached its peak in the 19th century. It vied for maritime dominance with Britain and Portugal. Oman stretched as far as Zanzibar in Africa. That's where the voodoo practices came from. 8. There's a unique piece of Oman inside the United Arab Emirates. Mata is an Omani exclave, located entirely in the UAE. Enclosed by Mata is Nawa, an Emirati enclave within the Omani enclave. This confusing configuration is the result of a referendum. In the 1930s, the region was ruled by rival clans. The locals were asked to choose their allegiances. Mata voted for the Sultan because the Omanis had more water. When oil was discovered, Nawa became much richer. 9. Oman used to thrive on frankincense trade. The Boswellia tree is native only to Oman and Somalia. Frankincense is made from this tree's sap. It used to be one of the most valuable commodities. Omani frankincense was exported even to China. The ancient city of Mirbat was a major trading port, but is now semi-abandoned. The abandoned houses have been taken over by Jinni.